Hello, hello, hello. This is Bishop Patrick L. Wooden Sr. Hey, I'm back. I know you wonder, what in the world has happened to him? Why has he gone? Well, I hope you've missed me anyway. I've missed you with our little chats on Thursday by inviting you to come out to service. I've been traveling uh, various ministry obligations, but I'm glad to be here today. And I am going to be at the upper room. And you can't miss tonight's uh, message. I'm talking from this subject anticipation still dealing with the divine partnership between the apostle paul and the church at philippi and and how paul went back 10 years and did a history lesson on his relationship with them and how they've had a wonderful two-sided relationship they with him and he with them but my friends he says even the things that god has done i anticipate that the Lord will continue to do those things. Nothing encourages a believer's heart like the anticipation that g what God has started, the Lord will finish. And I want to tell you something. You have reasons to look forward. You have reasons to serve the God of the Bible with positive anticipation. Now you got to come out tonight. You got to see what the Lord is saying. You got to be a part of this service. And guess what? This Sunday, Shiloh begins, and yours truly will be preaching the initial Shiloh message, and I am excited. Our theme this year is courageous, and I tell you, you got to be courageous in this day and time. You got to have courage. You got to have conviction, and you got to have the courage of your convictions. And my friends, I'm fired up. I have the courage of mine, and I'm sure you have the courage of yours. And if you do not, come out and hear the word of the Lord. It'll change you for a lifetime. It'll change you throughout for for all throughout eternity. So tonight, we're filled with anticipation. Come and hear the word of the Lord. You're going to be blessed. I promise you, you're going to be blessed. And I am going to be glad to see you. <laughs> see you tonight.